Good morning, afternoon, or evening, as the case may be, and thanks for listening to this demo tape. I promise not to take more than four minutes of your time. My name is Paul, and I'm a marketing consultant and freelance writer. Lots of people think they can write funny radio spots. Until they try. The following are three sample 60-second radio spots I've written. Please bear in mind I'm not attempting to display my acting skills, amazing and undiscovered though they be, or my production capabilities, although this tape was produced on some of the most advanced audio equipment of the 1960s. Thanks again for listening to the following. We're talking with the manager of Don's Carpet, where they bring carpet samples to you so you know immediately if the color matches your interior. And since we don't have a store, you don't have to pay our rent. You get a better price with Don's Carpet. Sounds great. Have you always done business this way? No, we started out like other carpet stores, trying to get customers to bring their homes in to be measured. Bring their homes in? Yeah, except for the trailer homes. That just didn't work very well. So we tried what other carpet stores do. We said, hey, leave the house at home. Just bring in the furniture to match our carpets. Your sofa, drapes, dining room table, chairs, but, coffee table, but, armoire. But that isn't the way other carpet stores work. It isn't? No, they make you drive to their store, guess about color, and borrow samples to take home. But don't you have to drive them back again? Sure, and if the colors didn't work, you may have to choose more samples and take those home. And then drive those back. Next, they send someone to measure your home and see how much you're really going to pay. Well, how do they make their money? Investing in Petro? We do all that on the first visit in your home at your convenience. Sounds kind of silly to buy carpet any other way. Don's Carpet, where our low overhead puts your new carpet underfoot for less. Call 703-555-1212 today for a free appointment. That's 703-555-1212. You have cars outside. Yes, that's generally the best place for them. What are you doing with all those brushes? I carried them here. <laughs> I see, but why? Because your ad said not to bring my car. How come other people get to drive their dirty brushes here? Uh, sir, they don't. When I first heard about you, I thought, pretty smart. After all, most people have dirty brushes lying around. I see you did. And not just hair brushes, paint brushes, shoe polishing brushes, rusty wire brushes, old toothbrushes. Smell those, will you? Uh, no, thank you. A uh, horse grooming brush. You have a horse? Would I have walked here if I had a horse? <laughs> no, silly me. That's what I don't get. Why couldn't I drive them here? Sir, so you shouldn't have bought them at all. You have pickup? No! It, this isn't Mr. E's carless brush wash? No! It's Mr. E's brushless car wash. You see, old-fashioned bristles damage a car's delicate surfaces, so our car washes have no brushes. Your car gets treated right, and with six locations, you know there's one near you. Well, speaking of that, can I get a lift home? Sorry. Oh, could you do the brushes just once? No. How about this big greasy one? Go away. Mr. E's brushless car wash. Fast, gentle, and thorough. And when you come, bring your car. We're asking people on the street to help us define a sandwich. A sandwich is defined by the bread's crust, ain't it? That's not exactly it's what the way I... your fence defines the boundaries of your farm. Yes, let's try over here. Pardon me, sir. How do you define a sandwich? Uh, you mean like a club. Exactly. Uh, well, a sandwich is the club I reach for when I teed off and found myself in a sand trap. Let's try again. Excuse me, sir. How do you define a sandwich? Sandwich is amazing. Lines in seashore in vast quantities. No, like you'd have for lunch. It goes down your throat. A sandwich. You went to launch your boat and it got stuck in the sand? <laughs> Here's someone coming out of a Metro sandwich and sub shop. Can you define a sandwich? Well, I just bought Metro's new super rib sub piled high with rib, basted in Metro's own tangy barbecue sauce, and smothered, in my case, with onions, lettuce, and a dash of salt. I don't usually do this with strangers, but take a bite. What do you think? That sounds tasty, but what I was really... Now you tell me. Hey! Now that's a sandwich. Metro Sandwich and Subs, we're redefining the sandwich. And that's a definition you can sink your teeth into. Sample commercials on this tape are copyrighted 1995. Unauthorized duplication in any form is prohibited.